magnets. You have probably used magnets. Most magnets are made of metal. They come in many shapes and sizes. But how do magnets work? How do we use magnets? We want to find out. A fork pushes or pulls something. Magnets have a special kind of force. Magnets pull some kinds of metal. They also push and pull each pull other magnets. Magnets cannot push or pull wood, plastic, or glass. All magnets have two ends called poles. One end is the north pole. The other end is the south pole. The north pole. Of one magnet will attract the south pole of another magnet. This means they will pull together. Two poles that are the same repel. This means they push each other away. It is hard to make two north poles or two south poles to touch. Magnets can move things without touching them. How can they do that? The force in magnets flows in lines. These lines of force. Flow through and around the magnet. They flow out of the north pole. They flow back in at the south pole. Lines of force around a magnet make a magnetic field. A magnet magnet can push or pull things in its magnetic field. You cannot see a magnet in a magnetic field, but it still work works. Try this. You can see lines of force working. A piece of paper on top of a magnet. Drop metal fillings on the paper. Shake the paper a little. What happens? The metal fillings line up in a pattern. This pattern shows the lines of force. Magnets can make electricity. A power plant uses giant magnets. They spin around coils of wire. This makes electricity flows inside the wire. You learned that magnets can make electricity, but electricity can make things be magnetic too. If electricity flows in a wire wrapped around the, a piece of metal, the matter turns into a magnet. A magnet made with electricity is called an electromagnet. It can be very strong. It can be turned off and back on. Many things you use have a motor. Electric, electric motors have magnets inside. The electricity makes the magnets spin. Then other parts can move too. More about magnet. Where did the word magnet come from? Long ago, people found strange rocks. The rocks pulled on iron. These rocks were found in. Magnesia, Greece, the word magnet comes from the name of that place. Because what happens if you cut a magnet in two pieces? You get two magnets. Each new magnet has a north and south pole. They both work. All these things use magnets. Let's review what you ha have learned about magnets. They are made of metal. They push and pull other metal. They have north and south poles. They can move things without touching them. They can make a. Uh, they can make electricity. Magnets are magnetic, magnificent.